Hi everyone, it's Zinnia here. Today I wanted to make a quick tutorial and show you how you can take animated GIF images and put them right into any Scratch project. Let's get started. So first, let's say that I have this Scratch project and then on my computer, I have this rainbow heart spinning GIF. And let's say I also have this fireworks GIF and I want to put them both into my Scratch project and have them actually animate. Here's how you can do that. So if you hover over the choose a sprite button and then go up to upload sprite and click on it, you can search for an item on your computer. And so let's start with the rainbow heart GIF. I can click to add that and it'll import. Okay, it comes in very large. Maybe I will set the size to something like 40. And if you go to the costumes tab, you can click on it and you can see that it uploads all of the frames of the GIF animation as different costumes of the sprite. So we have the whole animation right here. And if you want to actually have that animation play in your project, you can go to the looks category of blocks and drag out the next costume block. And if you click on that, it will make it go through the frames. And if you want it to play in your project, you can go to the control category and drag out a forever loop. And let's put this around the next costume block because now it will forever go to the next costume. And now we have our animation playing. You can also add a when green flag clicked block on top so that this animation starts when you press the green flag. And here's the last step I want to show you. Let's say you have an animation like this fireworks animation and you just want it to play one time, like the firework goes off once and then doesn't play again. Here's how you can do that. So I'll hover over the choose a sprite button again and click upload. And I'll pick the fireworks this time. And it's a pretty good size. And just like with the heart, you can drag out the next costume block and see all the frames of the animation. So if you want it to cycle forever, there's the forever loop. But if you want it to just go through the costumes a certain number of times, this repeat block is really useful. So I'll put that there. Now, how many times do we want it to play through its costumes? Clearly 10 isn't enough because that's only playing through a little bit of the animation. So let's see how many costumes it has. If you click on the costumes tab and scroll down, okay, it has 41 costumes. So what we can do is let's make it repeat 41 times. Let's see how that goes. Okay, pretty good, except that we want it to start at this first costume, like at the beginning of the animation. And the way you can do that is in the looks category, there's this block, switch costume, right above the next costume block. And what switch costume will do is it allows you to switch to a particular costume in the list. So let's have it switch to fireworks because that's the first costume and then have it go through the animation. Okay, so that's really good, except that right at the end, it comes back to that first costume because we actually only need it to go to the next costume 40 times because if we go to the next costume 41 times, we will go all the way to the end and then go back to the beginning. But if we only do next costume 40 times, then we will end here at the last costume. And that's what we want to do. So however many costumes your GIF has, if you want it to play once, you want to do a switch costume block and then do repeat that number of costumes minus one. And let's try, oh, let's put a green flag on top and try that out. Okay, so we've got the fireworks. And you know, I'll also make it show at the beginning of the animation and then hide at the end. So after it's played, you don't see these little specks. So there we go. Now we've really got the fireworks playing. Anyway, yeah, that's what I wanted to show you today. I hope that now you can add all of the GIFs that you want into your Scratch projects and have them animate. Uh, I'll see you next time. And scratch on.